Welcome to Polymer Update TV's weekly news for polypropylene, PP, for Friday, April 11th. This week, PP prices in Europe declined due to increased supply, lower feedstock costs, and weakening demand. Falling upstream oil and naphtha prices, along with geopolitical uncertainties, have led to cautious market sentiment. Despite a production disruption at Tarragona on April 1st, supply remained strong driven by low demand from the automotive and construction sectors. While packaging demand held steady, surplus supply was supported by competitive Asian offers and South Korean imports. Trade tensions between the US and EU added to the cautious outlook. The EU has paused retaliatory tariffs after the US imposed a 25% tariff on automotive imports, which could indirectly impact PP demand, especially since over 10% of Germany's automotive production is exported to the US. PP prices are expected to remain under pressure in April. Some market participants anticipate sharper declines than the Euro 55 per tonne drop in April's propylene MCP. Easter-related shutdowns at converters and weak industrial demand could further reduce buying activity. Looking ahead, Asian PP oversupply and falling demand for consumer goods due to US tariffs may result in more PP flowing into Europe. A stronger Euro could also support imports giving buyers leverage in price negotiations. Meanwhile, declining naphtha prices could lead to further feedstock cost reductions, potentially continuing the bearish PP price trend into May. Thank you for watching.